This year's Pi Day will be awesome. Not only that the year is a match, but we can extend that to include the time as well. And so, on March 14th at 9, 26 and 53 am, we'll have 10 digits of Pi. But we don't have to stop there. You see, all of the infinite digits of Pi could be reached on a single point in time on that date. If we were to stop the clock at just the right moment, we could, in theory, hit a jackpot. The entire Pi sequence to the infinity and beyond. A Pi instant. Of course, we are cherry picking the facts here. First of all, the year isn't 15, it's 2015. The year 1592 was a much better match. Also, almost the entire world writes dates differently, so Pi Day is, let's just say, impossible for us. But then again, who cares? We have this moment once in our lifetime and we're gonna take it. We are all familiar with the number pi, but the thing with all these mathematical constants is that unless you're really math savvy, you have to believe that that number isn't just made up. Unless you already know math, you can't really prove that one constant is correct while other one isn't. But pi is different, you can do that with pi. And the only thing you'll need is a ruler or a measuring tape and something with a circle on it, like this lid or this tape. First of all, measure the diameter of the circle. Then, put the circle at the starting position and mark that point on a circle. And then, you just have to roll the circle one full revolution and then measure what you've got. 